Hello, and welcome to another Let's Play Fallout New Vegas. Uh, sorry for not, uh, sorry for not actually, uh, playing this for a while, but I've been having too much fun with, uh, Minecraft. But hey. Okay, wait a minute, that dead horse. Okay, that's, dead horses are friendly, that's for this. Like the shadow of a ghost. No problem. Got him. Oh right, the green gecko spit. I really like this gun. It's a nice stealthy weapon. It works. Though I'm probably gonna go out the beaten path and just explore the areas. Because there is a gun here I do. Doing want. some actual scouting, not just following. Alright. First. See this? This is why your own two feet are better than any cart. Whether it's pulled by critters or goes on its own. This is actually pretty sad. Cause think about it. This was a car this is a bus crash. A little kids too. Now, I think I can uh, repair it. Yeah, I don't even need the parts. No, you don't. <laughs> Just turn up the volume on my side. Yeah, the program I use is called Snagit, so quite literally. Got him. Whoa. Gotcha. <sighs> that was rather annoying. So quite literally, I record a window, and whatever happens in the window gets put in. That's why I can record in very good quality. However, on that note, Snagit files are a little harder to edit. I can't, like, use Windows Movie Maker, as far as I can tell. And I'm not very good at editing, I'm not gonna lie. That's why, you know, you get all this. Why, when you follow me, you get all those problems. Alright, now, normally I wouldn't do this, but... Oh. Alright. Alright, so what enemy... Okay, how did he die? Damn it. Where is he? Where's his body? And how did he die? Son of a bitch. Alright. Well, at least it's saved. This time, hopefully, he doesn't get killed. I honestly have no idea what killed him. I'm 
Personally, I'd rather have him alive. I mean, granted, he's probably not gonna live. But hey, I wanna keep him alive as long as possible. Whoa. Here we go. Okay, so what enemy is here? It's probably another gecko. Oh, he took care of it. Alright, uh, so what was it? Okay, I was right, it was another gecko. Unfortunately, nothing on there, because I could have sold those hides. So, let's see what we got. Uh, I don't really, I don't want to bring that along. But will I ever bring these along? Hmm? Oh. Five pin. Okay, who keeps a cattle prod in here? In a toolbox? I mean, when would you ever... You know what, I'm not even gonna ask. You know, I don't even want to know. compass thing always knows where north is. Huh? Even if it can't see the stars? Yeah, that's pretty much how it works. What can I tell you? Alright. Huh. Only a little. When he came back. Well. We. We ra I want to know more about him. If it. Well, I guess I can't really talk to him about, because there's actually a bit of a plot where he'll ask, he'll want to know more about, you know, the world I live in, like. Right behind you. He, he wants to learn, he would want to move and visit my area. Personally, I think it's a pretty dumb idea for him, given that he, of his naivety, Naivities of his, of our world. There we go. All right, no tumbler fumbler, and some more ammo. A new hat. Another bobby pin. Ooh, gun case. Oh, hell yeah. I hit the jackpot. Now then, where should I put the... Oh, wait, I already have the mysterious magnum. So, I can just, yeah, I got it repaired. But I think I'll stick with the hunting rifle for now. It seems like a wise idea. Now, where I want to go is I want to get this a special gun in armor. However, the area to find it, honestly, I don't remember. Well, actually, I think I remember where I find the armor. The gun, however, I'm looking for is a little more, is obviously going to be, it's actually going to be a little more tricky, as I only have a vague idea where the area is. So, pretty much, I'm just going to be hoping I can find it. Hmm. Still, it shouldn't be too hard. But for now, let's just follow the road.
Eventually, I should come across what I'm looking for. Besides, I still got other stops I need to go to. Alright, you're still come following? How's your health looking? There can't really be a place where people go into big buildings and give away all their money just to watch someone flip paper squares on a table. Yes, there is. Now then. I believe there's traps here. However, there's also some items. Hmm. I'll take that back. No, there isn't. Well, there is, but nothing worth taking. Nice try. This would be so much easier if I had a scope. careful because I don't know if that's a white leg I'm gonna fight or if it's gonna be a Yagui oh whoa here we go it's just a giant rat that's not scary Although I will admit the rodents of unusual size when I first saw Look those sharp. lots of giant ants around here we call them picnic killers. Don't really know what that means. Something from back when, I guess. Hmm. things are ugly I've never liked giant ants not because they're annoying I mean yeah they're pretty easy to kill it's just the fact that they're so extremely detailed it's very creepy they did a little too well on the details and her friend. Anyway. Let's see. Let's repair the hunting rifle. And my submachine gun. Whoa. What the? Okay, that was weird. Don't know what just happened. Must have been nice. When Zion was friendly enough, folks could make camp wherever they pleased and not worry about white legs and deadly critters. I hear that. Alright, we're gonna go, I'm gonna go to bed. Let's get a good twelve hours of sleep. We don't have to worry. I'd rather you know, attack during the day. 
fighting during the daytime is certainly a lot better than at night. Alright. Didn't mean to have the anti venom, but eh, better than nothing. Wait, who keeps a tin can in their suitcase? Weird. Boom! Well, I'm running low on ammo. Guess we're going with the time again. Say hello to my... Oh, right. Say hello to my little friend. Fighting time. Bring it on. Oh, dead horse. Also, see if they want any help. Wait, what am I danger of? Uh, there's nothing on my radar. Hmm. There's nothing down there. I don't think there's anything up here. Hmm. The spitter plants and the green monster men aren't native to Zion. Wait. Wonder where they came from. Wait, what? Spitter plants? Guess I'm just jumpy. Oh, well, isn't this nice? Yogoi Cave. Yeah, let's just go. Hmm. Let's see. On my map. I think I'm somewhere in the right area. It's just that it's one of those things that I kind of know where it is, yet I don't. Then again, it's literally been like a year since I uh, played. Oh no! Back! You get the hell away from me. Who else is again attacking us? Oh. Guess I'm sticking with the Magnum. Alright, what do I want? Well, I definitely want to boost my speech up. And I'll add one more to that. You know, if I can talk my way out of situations, as well as help me get some extra guns, I'll take it. Yeah. Hmm. 
All right, let's wait for him to come to us. Oh, come on. Take you out. You want to fight? I'll fight you. Whoa! Bet they don't have anything as nasty as Yao Guai out where you come from, huh? Well, they do have stuff as nasty as red scorpions. Ugh, I hate those things. Hmm. I wonder if there's anything here I can loot. Then again, that would be kind of disrespectful. On the other hand, it might be smart to take some of this. Because I don't think the dead would want the living to die. So, taking some of this stuff could help. Yeah, I'm going to go with that logic. That's my story. I'm sticking to it. Now, there is something I do need to know. And this is something that's kind of important. Should I lower the time of my episodes to half an hour? Or go with, like, hour-long episodes? Because if I go with hour-long episodes, I can get more done without having to worry so much about... You know, too much running time. However, for longer episodes means that, you know, you get bored easily. You know, you're just like, come on, get on with it already. So for this one, I'm just going to have it go for half an hour. That way, you know, I can, you can get in a I can get in a sort of a, a readout on that, because I don't want you guys to get bored with me. For obvious reasons. He's still behind me. Let's switch up. There we go. I hear some odd things about the civilized lands outside Zion. Is there really a giant thunder lizard people live inside? Giant thunder lizard. Okay, that one, I... I honestly don't know the correlation. Is he talking about, like, the... The giant you know, dinosaur over at Novak? Is that what he's talking about? Too easy. Oh, all right. For as long as I remember, the dead horses have thought that places of the old world were taboo. Doesn't look so sp I can agree to that. It doesn't look really spooky here. Spooky to me. If anything, it just says it's useful. Alright, quest two is down. Oh, one more thing. Thing about, like, having a shorter episodes. I also would have... 
have a few problems with, uh, well, coming up with, you know, clever names for, like, the titles. You see, that's one of the funny, that's one of the things I do enjoy trying to do. However, it is hard to always think of, you know, a really good title. So, yeah, although I don't think that's, like, a deal breaker. I'm just saying. Uh, you got anything else to say, dude? Hmm. Wow, you're pretty tough. I like your hat. What kind of hat is that, anyway? I mean, it's like a baseball cap, but... Uh, this is like a pre-war sports team. Yeah. Like the shadow of a ghost. I like his uh, I like that club. I mean, it looks pretty awesome. So uh, hey, uh, you want to learn how to play some pool? I'm also get us a drink. We can relax here before we go on to our next episode. So I'm Brenton Kage, and I'll see you later.